Hey guys, I think I am live. This, I'm Kat, how are you doing? And I have my cat up there. Uh, so they're helping out at the office today. They're very, very helpful. Um, this is my first live on YouTube. I'm used to doing my lives on Facebook and I wanted to come on YouTube today. I have this cool thing. So I'm training myself to become my new identity because when I step into my end result, I tap into the feeling of this new person that has created the life that I love, that I want. And so it's different from who I am today. So I'm training myself every day, just, just like training, training a puppy. And you know you're going to succeed if you can do this. This is the eye curler experiment. And so, like I say, I'm doing weird things to just change my habits and to shift myself. And there was a weird thing going on where, so I need this because my lashes are too, this is really girly thing. So my lashes are really too straight. So I use this, this, this eyelash curler. And, but what I did is I used my right hand because my right hand can use it. My left hand cannot. So this is my dominant hand. Bear with me. So I used to do this with my right hand on my right eye. And then I do the same thing on my left eye. My left eye was always crooked and I got pissed, really, really pissed. Well, this, I said, this is why I said, this is not for kids, but I mean, there you go. And so I really got pissed. And then I said, well, this is, this is just an angle thing because my right eye is always okay, but not my left. But I was telling myself, I had a story. So what stories do you tell yourself about yourself? I had a story that I am not able to use my left hand to do my eye. And so what I did, I said, well, you're becoming someone else. Train yourself. If you can't train yourself to use your eye curler with another hand, how the hell are you going to train yourself to do all the things that your new identity needs you to do to create that successful business or that million or whatever you're going for. So that for me, that is my goal. And so I said, like, I mean, forget about it. Just do it with your left hand ever since. So the first time was really, really weird and I couldn't do it. It took me about two weeks and now I can do my left eye with my, my left hand. I said, Hmm, if I don't force myself, to do something that's unfamiliar to my body, I will never succeed to creating the business that I want. And that is my point, you guys. You are in a habit, like Joe Dispenza says, you're in a habit of being yourself. You have thoughts, you have feelings, and you have ha actions that you do on a day-to-day -day basis. We kind of repeat the same thoughts, the same actions that we did the day before right? But you're wanting a different future. It doesn't add up. You got to do something like we said. So I used to be uh, working in change management when I was in corporate. And we used to say, if you want to change something, you got to change something. So you can't, you can't expect to have the same thoughts, the same feelings, the same actions, the same habit and having different results. And so you have to train yourself one habit at a time. It's going to be uncomfortable, but that's good. If it's uncomfortable, you know that you're training your body to do something else. Hey, you're probably someone who drives a car, uh, plays an instrument, uh, plays a sport. You trained your body. You trained your body to do these things. And now you can just do it your eyes closed. Now, when you're wanting to create your business, create your dream life, you have to train your body how to play this new instrument. That's just what it is. One habit at a time. There you go. I have the link to my Facebook group. Come and join the community. It's like a, just some awesome, awesome creators that are creating their life and just changing one habit at a time to create the life that they want. When you do that, you completely crush the old habits that you have. And what we do is we do something like really cool. Let me talk about it a little bit. So we use the advancements of science. So epigenetics, uh, neuroplasticity, uh, NLP to train ourselves to a whole other level, just completely whole other level. So what we do is we can crush procrastination and doubt. We can crush self-sabotage 
and then you get your power back. You get your power back, you get your life back, you get your time back. That is freedom. So if you like this video, please put a thumbs up and uh, I'll see you in the next video. Have a great day, you guys. Bye.